But just Billy, so- Gunn, Billy Gunn doesn't just pull the claim aside and go, hey, boys, we need to go to WWE. Oh, I'm sure he's told them that. And I'm sure. Yeah, like, but listen, okay. you know, do you know what AEW offers, though, that's invaluable that AE, that WWE won't really offer is just that learning on the fly learning what to do and what not to do on the fly. Like in WWE, they're all about taking people and then trying to mold them perfectly. Yeah, for sure. For but sure, the people sure. who are who get the most over are the guys who know how to how to do shit. How to how to work on the fly. They think about the most over guys in the world, bro. Like that's why The Rock is such a phenomenon. He was just a pure WWF guy, but he he figured out that right. shit that like Triple H and Austin had to learn on the indies and working in WCW and shit. Th- that's the shit that that fucking um, the acclaimed and the gun boys. That's why Billy Gunn it probably encouraged his sons to go to AEW as well. He probably was like, dude, like you guys are going to learn shit here that you're not going to learn there. That's going to be more. That's going to give you a one up on the other people there. NXT ain't going nowhere. WWE ain't ever going nowhere. The guns are always going to have a run there. And uh, so is the acclaimed. Because I don't know about you, the guns are super over with me too. I'm sorry, I haven't seen them since they were just, you know, yelling at the at people on the side of the ring during COVID. So I can't, you know, <laughs> say this or that. You 